Kelantan, Malaysia was struck by floods recently with volunteers preparing aid supplies to be distributed to affected villagers. Here's more. In the aftermath of flooding Kelantan, city volunteers have prepared supplies to be distributed to affected villagers. A resident is riding his motorcycle, leading the volunteers to visit affected villagers. I feel very happy. Thank you for coming to help us. Thank you, Tsuji. Kelantan was devastated by floods in 2014. Back then, city volunteers gave affected residents aid supplies and living subsidies and also built prefabricated houses for them, helping them get through the tough times. <laughs> Back in 2015, Rahin has participated in city's construction of prefabricated houses for flood survivors. When volunteers visit his home, they found his family is immersed in sadness. Their child, who tried to save people in the flood three weeks ago, has passed away. There are four people, including him, on the boat. He has fallen into the water. There are patients and his friends on the boat. As they were caring for the patient, no one could save him. They told me that he has fallen into the water here. I went looking for him, but I could not find him. I only found his shoe. I kept calling him, but there was no response. Until now, Rahim's wife still cannot accept the fact her child has passed away. The master hopes that you can take good care of yourselves. The master and Global Tiji volunteers are willing to reach out to you regardless of race, religion or skin color. City volunteers have reached out to people in need again. Despite facing repeated natural disasters, city volunteers' love and care will always be there for the villagers.